Objective To study about human reproduction, the male reproductive system, accessory glands and semen. Male accessory glands The male accessory glands include a pair of seminal vesicles, a prostate gland and a pair of Cowper's glands. Seminal vesicles These are a pair of sac-like simple tubular glands. They are present between the urinary bladder and the rectum. Their position is posterior inferior to the urinary bladder. The duct of the seminal vesicle joins the vas deferens of its side to form the ejaculatory duct. The two ejaculatory ducts join and open into the urethra. The secretions of the seminal vesicle constitute about 60-70% to 70 of the volume of the seminal fluid. The secretions of the seminal vesicles are alkaline and viscous in nature. They contain fructose, proteins, citric acid, prostaglandins, potassium and inorganic phosphorus. Fructose is the main source of energy for the sperms. Prostaglandins help in the process of fertilization by making the mucosal lining of the uterine cervix more receptive to sperms. They also aid the movement of the sperms towards the ova by stimulating peristaltic contractions in the fallopian tubes of the female after coitus. Prostate gland It is located at the base of the urinary bladder. It is a chestnut-shaped, multilobular gland. A number of prostatic ducts open into the urethra. It secretes an odorous, slightly alkaline fluid called the prostatic fluid. This constitutes 30-40% to 40 of the seminal fluid. The secretions include citrate, zinc, calcium, phosphate ions and a number of enzymes. Cowper's glands or bulbourethral glands. These are a pair of pea-sized glands located on the sides of the urethra at the base of the penis. Their ducts open into the urethra. These glands secrete a viscous alkaline fluid. This fluid acts as a lubricant and also neutralizes the acidity of the urine in the urethra. It also acts as a flushing agent to remove the urinary residue in the urethra. Semen About 3-5 to 5 ml of semen is released during each ejaculation in man. It is an alkaline fluid that contains about 200-300 to 300 million sperms and seminal plasma. The seminal plasma consists of the secretions of the epididymis, vas deferens, seminal vesicles, and prostate gland. These are essential for the activity and motility of the sperms. The sperms are required to stay in the epididymis for some time to achieve motility. The sperms can survive for about four weeks in the epididymis. However, once ejaculated, they can survive in the female reproductive tract for up to five days only. The male accessory glands include a pair of seminal vesicles, a prostate gland and a pair of Cowper's glands. The secretions of the seminal vesicle constitute about 60-70% to 70 of the volume of the seminal fluid. Prostaglandins help in the process of fertilization by making the mucosal lining of the uterine cervix more receptive to sperms. Prostate gland It is located at the base of the urinary bladder. Cowper's glands or bulbourethral glands. These are a pair of pea-sized glands located on the sides of the urethra at the base of the penis. Their ducts open into the urethra. Semen. About 3-5 to 5 ml of semen is released during each ejaculation in man. It is an alkaline fluid that contains about 200-300 to 300 million sperms and seminal plasma.